Hello everyone. It's pressure here. Bingo. Adari. Which one of these names you may know me by. As I'm recording this video, just like a lot of you, I find myself experiencing and engaging in life through the many paths and the many roads and the many different emotional states and the many different mental states. And understanding that life, although may be a harsh teacher, although you may find yourself coming to the realization, whether it's through reflection, whether it's through meditation, whether it's through reading the scripture, Rather it's to just really just experiencing different things firsthand. And understanding that as the pressure gets applied, it's like a sword. When you're a sword master and you're building a sword, it has to go through the furnace. And what is the furnace? The furnace burns out the extremities. The, the discrepancies, the, you know, the odd, you know, everything that is not meant to be on the blade. Everything that will keep the blade from becoming sharp is burnt off and it's forged in this fire and it's banged upon with the hammer to straighten it, to curve it, to cultivate it, to, to get it into the desired outcome that it needs to serve. And thus, you go from something that would have been discarded like everything else, become a fine piece of craftsmanship. But it wasn't always like that, especially in the beginning. How many of us have find ourselves going through that fire, getting those discrepancies burnt off of us, realizing that the things that we were, hold on a second guys, my alarm going off for my daughter, I just took her to the bathroom, so I was a little ahead of it. But how many of us find ourselves in that fire whether you're dealing with family issues personal financial marital emotional spiritual mental how many of us find ourselves going down that path where it may it, it feels like it's a dark path but it's it feels like it burns it feels like it hurts it feels like you're losing your mind. It feels like you want to give up. It feels like you have no idea what's around the next corner. And you find yourself falling, getting a falling, falling. You find yourself. You find yourself questioning your strength, your morality, your mentality, your sanity, your spirituality. You find yourself divulging from a healthy physical state to where now you have ailments, the discrepancies on you that's keeping you from being the sharp sword that you need to be. Because a swordman's job is not to just cut you down, but it's also to protect. But you cannot get to that point without first going through the first steps and realizing that going through those first steps is what brings you closer to the goal. And understanding this, just as I'm understanding too, is what gives you the faith, as rough as it may be, 
If you could develop a faith as small as a mustard seed, you can bear the fire, but it won't destroy you. More so, it'll transform you. 